WTFNN. Headline news update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, Tuesday, 9 a.m. Eastern time, 30 minutes to go until that opening bell. And we got markets pretty calm to slightly in the red. Dow futures right now negative by just five points, trading at 26,757. We were lower overnight. We've kind of rebounded a bit. We'll jump over to the charts in a moment. S&P futures are negative two points, 29.49. NASDAQ futures negative by 10 points, trading at 77.48. Oil basically flat, trading at 57.92, and we've got the 10-year hovering right at about 2%, 2.007. We'll start things off. We're going to jump off with the VIX this morning. We'll check it out. Volatility index, VIX. 15.25, pretty tame day yesterday in the markets, not much action today, looking like it's going to open much the same. Jumping over to the futures markets, we'll start it off with the Dow 30. So as I mentioned, all the markets, and it's interesting to see them all three here, we'll jump through them. There's your Dow, S&P, and NASDAQ, all of them trading lower from about 9.30 last night Eastern time. Up until about 1 a.m. Eastern time, we reach a low of 26,685 in the Dow. We're about 90 points off of that level, 26,775. S&P is much the same. We make that low right at about 1 a.m., 29,42. We're approaching 10 points from that level. There's the NASDAQ 100. We trade lower just to see. I mean, there's 9 p.m. Eastern time. We're trading at 77.72. We trade down to the area of about 77.15. We're now up 40 points off that level, 77.54. Crude oil had traded lower as well until about midnight, reached a low of 57.25. Quite an acceleration going on right now as we have oil at 58.16. Gold contract, check that out, 14.41. Quite an acceleration. It did not stop until about literally midnight on the dot. We have gold reaching 1441, quite a high, now trading 1429, and the euro US dollar trading at 11393. In terms of what else you have happening out there, it is still earnings season. Lennar, the home builder, beating on profits as lower mortgage rates boost home sales. Checking out the Lennar chart, L E N. Quite a spike on that number to 5470, looking like it's going to open at 5325. And what you also have out there, quite a deal in the making, as you have Abby to buy Botox maker Allergen, Allergen, 63 billion. Stay tuned, folks. Larry Pezzavento coming up right now with Trade What You See. I'll be back at 10 o'clock. Have a great Tuesday.